So we see uh, Dougie Dakota went to a Air Force base so he could strut around, pump his chest, make him think he's a great patriot. <clears throat> yeah, that's what old Dougie does. He lies because Dougie's not a damn patriot. He's not a freaking patriot. Because when uh, when his orange shit stain in the White House was uh, mocking John McCain, who did Dougie side with? Well, he sided with the orange shit stain in the White House. He didn't sign with the POW to spend uh, five years in the Hanoi Hilton. No, Dougie didn't side with John McCain. Oh, Dougie sided with the old bone spurs. So when uh, <clears throat> when old Trump had uh, the name of the ship USS John McCain covered up because he didn't want to see the name, <clears throat> guess who Dougie sided with? The orange shit stain in the White House. Hey, Dougie, uh, why don't you ask some of those sailors what they think about covering up their ship's names? Ask them what they think about that, Dougie. Because you're probably going to get an answer like, Fuck you. You don't do that. That's the biggest fucking insult you could do to us. Yeah. But old Dougie thinks he's a patriot, so he goes to an Air Force base and, and pounds on his chest, tells everybody what, how, what a great patriot he is. Oh, yeah, he's such a great patriot with that big old freaking yellow streak down his back. So when uh, when uh, old Trumpo runs Lieutenant Colonel Vindman out of the Army, a Purple Heart recipient, old Dougie decides with the old orange shit stand instead of siding with uh, Lieutenant Colonel Vindman, who was subpoenaed, testified truthfully, but see, Dougie doesn't like that. See, when you go against the orange shit stain in the White House, Dougie doesn't like that a bit. Nah, he don't like it a bit. No, oh, you can't say that about old bone spurs. That's what old Dougie says. No, you, you can't talk about old bone spurs like that. So then when we find out that uh, Putin's paying bounties on our soldiers in Afghanistan, who does Dougie side with? Why, of course... The orange shit stand. That's who Dougie sides with. Screw those old soldiers out in the field getting shot at because there's a price on their head. That's what old Dougie says. Screw them. Got to go for the orange shithead. Yeah. That's what old Dougie does. He, he thumps his chest. Oh, he's such a great patriot. And then every chance he gets to actually back up the men and women in the armed forces... Dougie says, screw them. Because Dougie's got his head up Orange Buffoon's ass. But old Dougie will tell you all day long what a great patriot he is. Oh, he's a freaking great patriot. <clears throat> no, Dougie, you're not. You're not a freaking patriot. Because uh, your definition of patriotism is whatever comes out of the orange shit stain in the White House is oh so sweet. But when you pulled out the truth to old Dougie where every time he's had a chance to side with the men and women of armed forces, Dougie sides with the shit stand. Because that's the way Dougie is. <clears throat> you see, when Dougie tells you he's such a great patriot, he's lying. He's lying right through his teeth. Because Dougie doesn't give any shit about patriotism. Because he doesn't know what that is. Nah, he doesn't know what that is. You see, patriotism is standing by the country. Dougie thinks patriotism is standing by the president. That's what makes Dougie a liar. Because he's going to sit behind the shithead all day long. <clears throat> Putin can put bounties on our soldiers just fine with Dougie. But look, old Dougie, he's going to thump his chest in an Air Force base and say, oh, Oh, Dougie, he's so great. He's such a great patriot. Nah, Dougie, you're not. You're not. You're not a patriot, Douglas Dakota. 
because you got your head up, you want shit stains ass. And uh, how many weeks has it been since uh, Trump has known about these bounties on our soldiers, and what has he done about it? Not a damn thing, Dougie. Not a damn thing. Anytime he mentions, he say, well, it didn't come across my desk. Well, it's on your freaking desk now, you ignorant fuck. It's on his desk now, Dougie. What's he going to do about it? Not a damn thing. Because he's owned by Putin. So, Dougie, he thinks he's a great patriot. <clears throat> nah. Douglas Dakota is not a patriot. Douglas Dakota is going to side with the five bone spurs every time. Every time. Dougie's going to say, screw those soldiers over in Afghanistan that are getting shot at because there's money on their head. Dougie ain't going to say anything about that. No. No. When old Trump old mocks the Gold Star family, <clears throat> Dougie says, oh, that's great. Yeah, we need more of that. That's what old Dougie says. We need more of that. What we are to do, Dougie, is take away your uh, socialist check you get every month from the army. We are to take that away from you because you're not a fucking patriot, Douglas Cody. Now, you don't measure up to what it takes to be a patriot. So yeah, Dougie, screw you.